What's in the house is the manual we've all been looking for. It's like having your pediatrician, your therapist, and your mom, and 450 of the top parenting experts in your Wi-Fi connection to help you solve any problem at any time. We spent three years interviewing the top parenting experts from all over the country. Our mission with Kids in the House is to help parents become better parents. And action! It's very important when you explain to ADHD to a child that you use a strength-based model. I have great news for you. You have an amazing brain. You've got a Ferrari engine for a brain. Your brain is way powerful, and that's great. You're a champion in the making. But there's one problem. You've got bicycle brakes. You can't slow down when you need to, stop when you need to. And I say, and I'm a brake specialist. Oftentimes, as parents, we think of success as coming first. What we're aiming for for our kids is for them to be successful, and we assume that happiness will follow. But actually, we have hundreds of studies now that show that happiness precedes success. I'm a parent myself, and it's the job you care the most about in the world. I believe that our one to two minute videos can quickly get parents the help they need so they can get on with their day. Resilient children feel that they could make a positive difference in the world. That's why I always recommend to parents, have kids help other kids. Give them opportunities to help kids. Because what this does is, it says to the child, because I'm on this earth, this earth is a better place. Activity plus a sense of satisfaction equals motivation. I think we really need to change how female characters are depicted and left out in family-rated films. I think family meetings are incredibly important. I call for a family meeting and it's a time when we all gather and it's sort of an open platform for my children to speak about anything and everything. Parent to Parent is our social community. It's an opportunity to connect with people who are dealing with the same problems as you are and also to share ideas and come up with great new solutions. The first thing I would say to any parent who has just found out that they have a a newborn or an infant that is disabled and is experiencing uh, this multitude of what they would probably say negative emotions, it's okay. This is natural. You're human. The conversation has to start early with you instilling self-esteem in your children. Parenting is not easy, but we can help.